Well, the city of Stoughton has plans to replace a dam right off of Riverside Park Drive. And tonight, some residents are worried the project is going to do more harm than good. NBC 15's Colton Molesky went to Stoughton for the full picture of that controversy. One dam in the middle of Stoughton, but two sides to the story. Because the river is Stone's history. That dam is history to Stone. What it'll do is it'll bring people in from other communities. Stoughton Mayor Tim Swadley says the six-year plan to reconstruct the dam and add a water park already approved by the city council will bring in money for businesses and new people to the city. We had a community member that was in Iowa in 2017 that saw a project there that they thought would be neat if we could try to replicate here in Stoughton. But a group of people in Stoughton are concerned about the cost benefit of the project. We don't believe that the technical information justifies the position that the city of Stoughton is taking. Buck Sweeney is an attorney taking the case pro bono and says this will adversely impact people above and below the dam. This kayak uh, trail which have failed in other parts of the country is going to cost the city of Stoughton. One of the several community meetings Wednesday laid out the costs attendees say will exceed $9 million in the coming years. The mayor saying it will cost around 2 and DNR grant money will take the brunt of the cost. We will have a contested case hearing will be the first step. We'll file a, an action of circuit court to have a restraining order. If they go through with the current plans, my plan is to tie this up for years. It has a lot to do with... Uh memories of the dam and the river, the way it, it, they've grown up here and come to enjoy it. The mayor is hopeful that this project can begin by the end of the year, pending the DNR's approval. In Stoughton, Colt Molesky, NBC 15 News.